Hi, we're here today in the Wickford Centre meeting local organisations from around the area, telling them about the availability of lottery funding. And it's an important day for us because we want to make sure that people in the Rayleigh and Wickford area are able to access information and advice and support about how to apply for good cause funding. And I'm very fortunate to be, to be able to be joined today by a couple of our delegates who represent Crossroads Care Essex. We've got Laura and Sarah. Hello. Hi there. Hello. So what, what, why are you here today, I suppose, that's my first question. We want some money. <laughs> that's a pretty good answer. And what does your, what does your organisation represent? We, um, we, we, well, basically, we're in the Coles Point area, Rochford and Rayleigh area, and also in the Malden area, and we provide respite care for carers. But we also have a day centre currently on Canby Island, um, and we also have, we support young carers. Um, but we're moving. We're moving to a, a big premises, which is going to give us so much more um, facilities for the people that we care for. So obviously our project is to support what we do and obviously expand on, on what we do. We know there are an awful lot of carers within our area um, that either don't know their carers or don't know where they can get support from. So what we want to do is obviously make sure that we get the support that they need and help them access that support. So this sounds exactly the sort of place you needed to be this morning. And have you found it useful? Have you found the advice that you've heard from both Big Lottery Fund and the other funders that have been present today, which are Arts Council, Sport England and the Heritage Lottery Fund? I mean, obviously it's Big Lottery Fund money that you're interested in. Has it been useful? Um, I think it's definitely been useful for us today. Um, we're both quite new to dealing with the funding side of the organisation, so it's really useful to come along and listen to exactly what the criteria is, exactly what needs to go into an application and what doesn't need to go in. Um, so, yeah, I think it's definitely been a big game. That's really helpful. I mean, would you advise this kind of workshop approach to other, other people that you might, you know, work alongside and this sort of thing? Did you find, you know, to have a half a day just coming to learn about the do's and don'ts and, and particularly what we might not fund so we're not going to waste people's time? Would you, advise, would you recommend this kind of approach to other people? Yeah, I mean, I think, I mean, we, we've been on sort of other funding days together and I think the approach that this one has taken has been so much better just, just to have people that are involved within the societies who give you the money so you actually can put a face to the name. Um, yeah, it's been so much better than, than the places we've been before. That's really good to know. And the idea that it was being held on Friday the 13th didn't put you off at all, did it? <laughs> good. Thanks very much for your time. Thank you. Okay.